Come on, look how fired up he was before the game. Michigan State's defense this season ranked the top three in total defense, rush defense, and points allowed. And the defense dominated early. Braxton Miller to Carlos Hyde, upended by Trey Waynes. Yeah, they have tremendous speed, and the secondary is not afraid to put their face in the fan and tackle. Miller, nowhere to go. The, the pocket just collapses, sacked by Ed Davis. They don't over-pursue plays. They keep Braxton Miller in the pocket. Again, you've got the athletes in the front seven. Bring him to the ground, and Urban Meyer causing a headache early. Yeah, first time this season, Ohio State has been shut out in the first quarter of the season. Then Connor Cook, the guy you mentioned, to Keith Mumphrey, 72-yard touchdown. did a very good job attacking the safeties in that Ohio State secondary, and that's been the weakness, trying to create mismatches on weaker cover players. Miller looking to get Ohio State's offense going flushed out of the pocket, running the Michigan State territory, and he can do this with his legs, 48 yards. They never had the football early in this game. Michigan State was able to keep drives consecutively going, but Braxton Miller and that scrambling ability we've seen. He was averaging 11 yards a carry in the last three games heading into tonight. First and goal, left, turns the corner, touchdown. Ohio State tied the game at 17. This is why, Bra this is why Braxton Miller is the most dynamic player that Urban Meyer said he's ever coached. Miller on the keeper, Ohio State State, 24 unanswered points. They're up by seven. Fourth quarter, though, it'll be Cook rolling right, and it's to Price for the touchdown. It's a tremendous play call. You get a bootleg fake, working the cut flow back across his body to a tight end. Mike Sadler's punt blocked by Ryan Shazier. Ball rolling down to Michigan State, 47. And Ohio State with a short field to work with. Again, special teams playing a huge part, and this is the play people are going to be talking about. Fourth and one, Miller running right, stop short of the first down. you got to love the play call if you're Ohio State. This has been working all season long for Ohio State, especially earlier in this game, trying to get the edge, but Michigan State just too tough in their run day. Later on, Jeremy Langford finding a hole, taking it in for the touchdown. Michigan State up 34-24. At that point in time, that was pretty much all she wrote was to see Urban Meyer's reaction there at Ohio State walking up the field knowing this did not happen the way that they anticipated it to be. And meantime, break out the roses for Michigan State. They're going to be facing Stanford as the Cardinal back-to-back -back Rose Bowls. And what a victory for them. Ohio State had moved to number two in the BCS standings following Bama's loss. But instead, Meyer had been a perfect 24-0 as Ohio State head coach. The biggest test for him since taking over came in.